The 716 in two minutes. Brought to you by Custom Carpet Centers. Hi everyone, I'm Katie Morris. Let's take you through the 716 in two minutes and see what's making headlines today. Governor Cuomo in more hot water. New reports claim state health officials were told to prioritize his family for COVID-19 testing at the onset of the pandemic. According to reports from a number of outlets, including the Albany Times Union, the New York Times and the Washington Post, Cuomo's brother Chris, his mother Matilda and at least one of his sisters were given access to COVID tests as early as March of last year before tests were widely available to the public. A North Tonawanda man is is dead after a single car crash in Wheatfield. It happened last night on Williams Road. State troopers say a Jeep ran off the road and hit a number of trees. 49 year old Jeffrey Santacero was the driver and the only person in the car. He died at the scene. An autopsy is now being done. And another summer tradition has been canceled. Canal Fest of the Tonawanda is not happening this year. This is the second year in a row this popular event has been canceled because of the pandemic. The festival was scheduled to kick off July 18th. And Autumn is tracking a forecast that's going to be changing, Autumn. And we have the clouds that will be filtering in the rest of the day. Temperatures near 70 degrees, but take a look at this hour by hour forecast. It turns wet by the time we head later this evening. And even through the overnight, the potential for some scattered thunderstorms will be there. Some rain heavy at times into early Friday and temperatures will tumble through the day on Friday, turning windy as a frontal system passes by. That's why we have a high wind watch in place for Western New York. We'll be turning to a warning as we get a little bit closer here. These gusts near 60 miles an hour will end up happening. As we look at the wind gust tracker, we'll find those highest gusts that will be near the lunch hour a few hours before, a few hours after, and then tapering off for the rest of the day. Power outages, a low to moderate risk through the day on Friday. And not only that, we're watching our temperatures tumble. We're going from near 60 in the morning into the mid 40s for the afternoon and even into the 30s into the evening. To wrap it all up, you're going to see those temperatures drop. We have those gusts that will be coming through and even a few flakes into the evening. The 716 in two minutes brought to you by Custom Carpet Centers.